It's square, right? It's a square thing. Is it a perfect square? No, I don't know. So this is how you lay them out. That's how I lay them out. So that's what you're doing right now. You're in the process of laying out all the posts and the timbers. That's what we're doing. What are we doing ultimately here? <laughs> Building a barn. How big is it? 20 by 18. Where? 18 by 20. Here in Maine, 18. out of timbers milled in Maine. Out of eastern white pine. Eastern white pine. And you got all the notches. We've got them all laid out. And so break it down for me and, <laughs> and the and the people all over the world, the tens of people all over the world watching this. Um, the public at large. At large. So what do you what do you so what are we doing? When here? I come in with a what are we doing here? This is post. <laughs> this post. Post this good. Post with this is this is our post right here. Okay, B1. That's it, B1. So we'll label the bottoms or something once they're cut yeah, or... That's you... the bottom. Okay. That's the top. Great. Um, so I've got them measured to length to the top and then there's a tenon. Okay. I'm not telling the camera, I'm telling you. Yeah, no, I, you're, you're telling me and I'm paying attention. Um, what are, what's this? That, so this is our, this is our girding beam. This is our 8 by 10 by 18 that's going to carry yep. the floor system. This is the space of the knee wall? Or yep. the height of the knee wall? Yep. It's okay. two feet. Okay. Two feet. Yep. Um, so that was going to be the 8x10 coming in here Okay. with a 2 inch tenon yep. and it's a through tenon right to the back A side. through tenon and it's sitting on a half inch. And it's sitting on a half inch housing. Okay. And it has pegs. That's what these are marked. Those are pegs. Peg marks, okay. Um, That's great. And a lot of times you do them straight but offset, it, is. offset is better to yeah. not go in the grain. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. Um, yeah, Rusty doesn't typically do this. He likes to do this angled one. That's what I did. I like it, but I've just it's a seen pain. It. I've seen it a lot of times, so I like to make it. And it's a little bit different. I would say it's probably more time consuming to cut. Yeah. Yeah. Um, this is easy with a router. Yeah. So we got a brace at from because that's actually reduced to nine and a half. So it should be about a half inch down at four feet yep. from that point. So that's our three, four, five, four feet yep. going up. That brace comes in like that. Okay, so what's this gonna look like? That's our mortise. Yep. We have a two and a half inch shoulder. Okay. And then and then a bare faced mortise. So a tenon on the on one side of the brace. Yep, I know, I got that. And then is this gonna slope in? Yep, that's a slope. Down and to... then it's four inches deep. Okay. And that's a square. Great. Thing that's there. square down there. That's, that's sitting there. flat. Yep. Yeah. Um, another that's... peg on that. Um, and this is a nailer. Oh, we're going to carve out a we'll, four by four? Yeah, we'll use a four by four nailer. We'll just set it in a half inch. It oh, just, really? It just hides the cut. Oh, wow. And then that way you can get a screw in there from the backside. Just set it in a half inch? Yeah, like the four by four will be coming in. Okay. Oops, yeah, yeah. Oh, like that. Okay, I got yeah. you. I was thinking like that. Yeah. Like this. Yeah. Great. And then a long timber lock or whatever. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Just yeah. screwed one way or the other. Cool. Because this is the outside of the frame. Okay. So that get it buried. Great. And this is the bottom? And that's the bottom and it's just a little stubby ten and two inches tall. So cut this off. Mm-hmm. And then cut all this away. Mm-hmm. And this and actually, how this long is, is the tenon? This is actually, full eight inches. This actually oh. goes away. It's it's going to be six inches, two inches get cut off because that's the outside of the building. So oh, it's just a it's a stump. Yeah, it's a six by eight yeah. tenon. Yeah, pretty much. Okay, this is a little stump just to just to help locate. To lock it in, two inches deep, six right. by eight. Okay, um, great. So 
Yeah, I'm gonna lay all of them out, and then I'll have you check. You'll come back behind me with a tape measure. That's what I figured. And we'll check all the measurements. And how are we gonna do that? Because is it written down anywhere? Or is yeah, it all? Yeah, I have it all written down, okay. lengths and measurements. Okay, great. Um, so we'll, we'll check all Before cutting. Yeah, before cutting. It's, it's and important. then um, we're gonna knife some of the shoulders. Um, the ones that we care about, basically. The visible ones. Yeah. Meaning, and the knifing is what you were doing that's just a second ago. Doing. With that square. Yeah. And that's specifically a tool for this. Yeah. That is a timber framing tool. Right. That's really cool. Because it's, it's inch gradient. I've never seen one. Yeah. It's, they, this is like the super fancy one. They make a basically one without any measurements yeah. on it. Yeah. Yeah. But that inch gradient, because everything you're doing is in inches. Yeah. And then if you flip it over to that side, you're a half inch gradient. Wow. So everything, you know, it's it makes it so fast. Yeah. Like if you're doing it's a this, layout square. That's yeah. so cool. If you're doing this like a lot, this speeds up. The oh god, yeah. Yeah. I mean, you could do it with the framing square, but then you're like. Yeah, that's what I. It takes a little more time consuming. Yeah. Which is it works. He's got a bandsaw mill in his shop. He does? Yeah. I guess I knew that. Tim Beal. Did you know him before this? No, I just went from YouTube. Okay. It's like, every, every time it's like Excalibur. Yeah. Fucking sword in the stone. <laughs> There's a pin right there. You're gonna have to come up with a theme song for this video series. <laughs> so, with lyrics and all. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know, lyrics, music, all of the music. So you're gonna have to do drums. <laughs> Jack White could do it. John Lennon could do it. You could do it. Yeah. As far as I'm concerned, if you claim to be a musician, then then you should be able to do this. You should be able to do that. So and then just. Yeah, and then I just hit him That's on it? that side. That side. I didn't drill mine until they were together. Yeah, right. 
so I couldn't do it from that way. Right. Because you're lying on the foot of the tape, like just like on the timber. Because if I was doing like, that's not that accurate. That's the thing. The outside all, corner. All, all my measurements, like, are pulled from that. That's real rain, and here we are. Totally dry. Totally dry. It's nice. Yeah, it's a good place to timber frame. Yeah, it is. It's beautiful. Oh yeah, it's beautiful. It's pouring. So it, it, it clamps against the side that it's it pulling. It uses a fence, yeah. Yeah. Can you climb up there? I mean, that's pretty fast.
And action! Magnificent.